Today, Governor Gavin Newsom addressed the California homeless crisis at a press conference announcing a new program intended to help those who are struggling with mental illness and experiencing homelessness. KSBY News reporter Delaney White joins us live with details about the plan. Delaney? CareCore is designed to help those struggling with mental health and substance use disorders within our community in a kind and compassionate way. And local mental health experts say this could be a game changer for how we help those who are struggling within our community. At a press conference Thursday, Governor Gavin Newsom announced a new program to help individuals who are struggling with mental health and substance use disorders. The Care Court program is designed to connect these individuals with a court-ordered care plan as well as a supporter for up to 24 months. The ultimate goal of this program is to get struggling people off the streets and into treatment and housing. Care Court will also connect struggling individuals with a care team in their community that can include stabilizing medication, clinically prescribed individualized treatment with supportive services, and a housing plan. Transitions Mental Health Association Executive Director Jill Bolster-White says this will improve the ability of San Luis Obispo and Santa Barbara counties to offer services. It sounds like it has um, some elements that would change some of the regulations, some of the impediments to treatment. Bolster White explains Transitions Mental Health Association contracts with County Behavioral Health and works with hospitals and law enforcement. From what it sounds like, the care court would actually help um, some of those groups do better coordination and do a better job of addressing the needs of folks who are unhoused. Five Cities Homeless Coalition Executive Director Jana Nichols says we have a number of people who qualify for these services. I'm very supportive of this act and really hopeful that it goes all the way through the legislature and it's enacted. How we actually do that, I have no idea. Nichols says the housing scarcity on the Central Coast could make the program difficult to successfully implement. I know that our behavioral health um, services in the county will be challenged to meet that, both by virtue of housing and then the availability of staff. Though Nichols sees potential challenges, she says she remains hopeful about the success of this program. We have our challenges ahead if we are really to implement this in an effective way. For more information about Care Court, visit KSBY.com. Reporting live in San Luis Obispo, Delaney White, KSBY News.